What's happening guys, it's Bharat Nagpal for iGand at In and today we are looking at something really special. It's the Samsung Galaxy Note Pro. Now this 12.2 inch confusion of a device is a tablet that runs Android with uh, Samsung's own user interface that they call the Magazine UX. This device was launched at CES 2014 in Las Vegas earlier this year and we went hands on with this device at launch. However, it's now here at our office so we'll be doing a quick unboxing and a quick hands on with this device. So let's talk about what all is inside the box. So the packaging is very Samsung like so you have a recycled paper box with minimal printing recyclable ink so that's good eco-friendly packaging inside the box you get the tablet itself usb 3 charging cable which is nice you have a quick start guide along with warranty information a wall charger and a extra set of stylus pins or for the s pen is included inside the box and is used with the tablet itself so that's everything from uh, the device box uh, let's go and take a look at the hardware on this guy so we're running a exynos uh, chipset on the inside it is a Exynos 5 Octa and it has a quad core 1.9 gigahertz along with a quad core 1.3 gigahertz CPU combination and you have the Mali T628 MP6 GPU. For cameras you have an 8 megapixel on the back and a 2 megapixel on the front both capable of 1080p video at 30 frames per second. On the inside you have 32 and 64 gigabyte storage capacity options and 3 gigabyte of RAM along with micro SD card expandability up to 64 gigabyte. The front of the device has a 12.2 inch 256 by 1600 pixel density which gives it about 247 pixels per inch making it one of the highest resolution tablets available on the market you do have 10 point multi-touch on this device now this has been launched in india for a price upwards of 60,000 rupees and on the box the price is 69,000. so expect it for much less once you go hunting for this device now if you take a look around the device on the front we have the two megapixel camera that i spoke about earlier and you have the samsung logo along with a bunch of sensors and below that you have the 12.2 inch display along with uh, a hardware button at the bottom which is the Samsung home button a multitasking button and a back button if you look at the bottom of the device they've kept it fairly clean so nothing on the bottom on the right hand side is where most of the action is so you have the sim card slot the micro SD card slot and the USB 3 charging port along with one side of the speaker and the S Pen uh, which you can pull out when you need to use it on the top you'll see an infrared blaster the microphone and uh, volume buttons the main microphone pinhole and the power button for the device on the left is the 3.5 millimeter headphone jack the secondary speaker for the set of stereo speakers and on the back is the 8 megapixel main camera the note 3 style pleather finish but definitely seems softer on the note pro looks nicer feels better now the device is running samsung's new boxy magazine ux it's a build up on touchwiz and it seems to be much more fluid much more faster than the touchwiz we know and it also runs on kitkat so that means you get a faster overall experience and this new ui makes it look nicer makes it look good now you have a bunch of things happening on the main screen so if you pull all the way to the left you get your new magazine ui so you can jump into news sports etc this is mostly running on flipboard so uh, that is what you will see most of the other things are generic to samsung so you do get a bunch of samsung applications that are preloaded onto the device you also get sketchbook s note and your s pen applications that you can use With this new version of the galaxy note pro you also get uh, the functionality that you saw on the note 3 so you can pull out the air command menu and jump onto action memo the scrapbooker screen write s finder and pen window options as you did on the note 3 now this has been designed to run a lot of enterprise applications so you do get webex for free you also get remote pc applications and e-meeting applications along with the file viewer and business week preloaded on the device you can also connect via cisco's webex uh, for free for the first three months so that's great so you get good enterprise functionality out of the box the user interface is fast and responsive and if we load up the website on uh, the device uh, you'll see that it runs very very fluid better than we've seen it running on any other samsung device as you can see it loads the full website on uh, the device and it looks beautiful absolutely gorgeous on uh, this high resolution display so we're pretty happy with the way the screen looks and of course scrolling panning etc is good colors are accurate and uh, viewing angles are great thanks to this being an lcd display as opposed to the super amoled uh, which sort of blurs out in highlight conditions uh, this one looks nice and has, has great viewing angles watching videos is also great on this and we will load up a quick video to show you that let's quickly jump into youtube and play one of our videos Box will look like. So we have the device. First, I'm going to put that to the side. 
So there you go guys, uh, this was a quick look and uh, unboxing of the new Samsung Galaxy Note Pro 12.2 inch, a hybrid uh, larger than life tablet from Samsung uh, running Android KitKat and the new magazine UX. We'll be back with a full review on this tablet. So if you have any questions, queries or anything that you would like to check out on this device, do let us know in the comment section below and we'll try and hit you up on that soon enough. This has been Bharat Nagpal. Thank you guys for watching. Do subscribe to us on YouTube and make sure you check us out on iGAN.in. I'll see you in the next one.